Unsolved, Episode 108, Zodiac Killer Case, Peggy Kelly. Remember several episodes back, I pointed out Peggy Hamlin worked as a cocktail waitress at Terry's Coffee Shop, and I didn't know if she was relative of Rodney Hamlin. Well, now I know. And so this episode is going to explore that idea or that connection. The connection between the murder of Sherry Jo Bates at Riverside City College in 1966 and the connection to the murders, the Zodiac murders, the first two in Vallejo, California. And the connection between Terry's Coffee Shop where Darlene Farron worked as a waitress and Peggy Hamlin worked as a waitress during the murder or during the time of the murder of Darlene Farron. And I showed you that Dennis Hamlin, Denny, lived in Vallejo during the time that Darlene Farron was murdered. And you can see in this graphic, Dennis Hamlin, and then lower below him, you can see Peggy Hamlin. And then you can see in this graphic in 1967, that Dennis Hamlin lived in Vallejo, but Peggy's not there. Well, that's because she was in San Diego when she recently married Joseph K. Hamlin, or Joe. And that information brings us to this graphic of Peggy Kelly in her 1958 high school yearbook photo. And this is her in her sophomore year. And she left school because she married someone, Mr. Biggs. <laughs> but she ended up divorcing him. And then she ended up marrying another gentleman, a gentleman that we know as Joseph Hamlet. And now, is this the Joseph or the Joe Hamlin that she married? Well, this Joe Hamlin went to school in 1963 or graduated from school from Ramona High School. And this Joe Hamlin just happened to be attending Riverside City College in 1966 when Sherry Jo Bates was murdered after leaving the library. So, that brings up the question, is Joe a relative of Rodney Hamlin? And would Rodney Hamlin visit his relative at the Riverside City College? Would he visit him in Vallejo? Well, you're just going to have to wait until next weekend before I tell you. <laughs> so I'll see you then.